According to the Mammoth and Ocean County Food Bank, 1 in 10 people in our area consider themselves food insecure, and due to COVID-19 restrictions in local businesses, these numbers will only increase. People are also faced with a difficult decision to risk their health and safety while shopping for groceries. My friends and I wanted to find a way to ease people's worries during this difficult time and help people get back on their feet. The inspiration for Hillel Kirk came from an organization called Food Not Bombs, where we aim to feed people regardless of need. And this year we did see a big surge in people reaching out to our group, so that definitely helped me see how much this pandemic has been affecting my community. Calabacar aims to allow everyone the means of receiving their groceries. Let's take a look at the app. The sign up button takes you to a screen where you can enter the information we need to create your account. Next, the app will ask the user whether they want to sign up as a donor or a shopper. A donor has the ability to assist people in their shopping, whether that be by paying for some of their groceries or physically buying and delivering it. A shopper is someone in need who can use Calabacar as a way to post their grocery lists on a public forum. Finally, if the user chooses the shopper option, they will be asked to enter their home address. Shoppers also have the option to abstain from giving their information, opting to instead pick from a list of public locations to pick up their goods. Once logged in, the user will be sent to their homepage. On the donor home screen, you'll see a bulletin board with various shopper orders posted on it. You may click on one to donate to. Once there, you can decide how you would like to contribute. The Stores Near You page is there to assist donors in finding places to shop with ease. The user may add people that they've helped in the past and get notifications if one of their friends ha has a new order. Donors may contribute by donating money, buying and delivering groceries, or both. If donating money, the app will ask the user to enter the amount they'd like to donate. This is then followed by a choice of using PayPal or Venmo. If shopping and delivering, the user will fill out a proposed day and time, along with the proposed address where the groceries will be delivered. This will be sent to the shopper and will be approved by them. Unless the donor is doing both, the delivery person will be reimbursed through PayPal or Venmo by Calabricard. The shopper's homepage is where the user may see their order, along with its status, and make any quick edits. For a better look at what has been taken care of regarding their order, they may click on the button in the upper right-hand corner to get to their order details page. The grocery list page is a place where the user may customize the grocery list further. The friends page is where the shopper may add donors that they want to connect with more than once. I'm Jacob and I'm the Java lead for this project. We utilize Android Studio to create the back end of this application. Hi, I'm Erin Hardiman and I'm the project manager of Collaborator. And I'm Melody Lynn, the XML lead for the app. We use Adobe Photoshop and Illustrator for the logo and we use Android Studio for the front end design. Collaborator allows people to give back to their community, provide those in need with the means of caring for themselves and their family, and forms connections that will last a lifetime. Thank you so much for giving us the opportunity to showcase our app.